is Liz. Welcome to my channel. Today I have a special guest, and that's my sister. So if you actually want to see me do a, my full night skincare routine, and it's a nine-part skincare routine with my sister. Did you say nine? Nine. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> then please keep watching. Alrighty guys, let's get right into it. So first off, we have a guest, first guest on my YouTube channel, and that is my sister Alexandra. I'm very honored for you. <laughs> I don't know what the benefits are, but <laughs> we just like it, so. I have a really, really big skincare. I don't use every single item in this. I'm, most of these items I'll, I, have, I'll, I use every single night. There is one or two products that I kind of do every second night, but I'll show you them, and we'll go right through them with my sister. So first off, you want to cleanse your face. I always double cleanse. So I'm going to be using my Pharmacy Whipped Greens product right over here. Why do you double cleanse? You want to take off your makeup for the first the first layer and then afterwards you really want to just clean the pores out and get really into it and sometimes you want to try it like just wash your face and then afterwards just put a, like a toner with a little uh, cotton pad like this and you will see that there's still some makeup on your face so it's really important to double cleanse and I feel like it makes the biggest difference on my skin. So uh, I am going to be using the Whipped Greens Oil Free Foaming Cleanser with Moringa and Papaya, which Pharmacy has recently become one of my favorite skincare brands ever. So let's get right into it. I'm so excited. <laughs> Yay! We're going to wet our face first and we're going to put this on. So we're going to rub it in, really get in there, go all the way around. Don't forget your neck. Mm, this makeup smells off. so good. Mm -hmm. What is it like? A it's Papaya and Moringa, which I don't that is by the way guys if you want to check out prices and products i'll have it listed in the description below so check it out mm, it smells so mm -hmm. good this brand this product and brand is like one of my faves right now so all right we're gonna clean our face and we're gonna be right back <laughs> all right you guys always pat dry your skin never swiping it because you don't want to get wrinkles you don't want to pull on your sensitive skin you want to make sure you're youthful as long as possible, right guys? So make sure your padding always dry. All right guys, we're ready. I know, so we're going to have some more liquid luck. Ah, uh, cheers me girl, what is this? Cheers. She doesn't know. <laughs> so do you do this every night? Every night, darling. I wear makeup every single day because I just love it. I love makeup. <laughs> so by the way, what is your daily skincare routine? My darling. <laughs> I, mean, I wouldn't call it a skincare routine. <laughs> it's like, uh, well, I don't wear makeup every day. I'm usually on the weekends. So uh, during the week, it's just like water and soap. And then uh, I use sometimes in the shower the stuff that you gave me, the Tula exfoli <laughs> exfoliator. Yeah. And uh, that's about it. Simple, you know, with a toddler, you gotta be quick. <laughs> True. I do think I'm gonna try getting her into the skincare life because. I think it's important to take care of your skin, mostly being a mother, being busy, True. getting being, older, getting those, you know, dark circles. We need to fix that, honey. <laughs> so let's get right into it. Let's get to the next product, my love. <laughs> we gotta, we gotta, we're talking too much. We're drinking too much. We're only in one product. Okay. So let's talk about one of my favorite skincare brands and skincare item actually. And that is the Dr. Brand. You're going to hear that a lot actually. No, it's my favorite or everything, but no, this is actually a brand that I really, I've been using it for the last six years. Absolutely love it i have dry skin you have a would you say dry it's combination dry. fine yeah she has dry skin too so we both have really dry skin so i feel like you need to exfoliate take away that dryness take away the dead uh, skin cells so then we have to use an exfoliating uh, product this is a pore perfecting exfoliator it just helps refine the appearance of pores deep cleans pores and helps smooth the appearance of skin texture 
we don't actually have any texture thankfully we have pretty good clear skin i would say we just have really dry skin and thanks to our mom thanks to our mom we did inherit some really good skin so uh let's get right into this product here again all the products will be listed below with the prices this is a rather expensive product actually but I love it. Is this something you do every night though? Because I thought I don't. Like so a days a week. By the way, this is this is good to use two to three times a week. I only use it twice a week. If I feel like my skin is super super duper dry or like it feels a little off or whatever, then I will probably do it three times. But I only use this maybe once to two times a week, preferably. So this is the skincare I don't, I don't use every night. So I could do that. Yeah, yeah. we're gonna nice. try it out yeah. now. So first, we have to dampen your skin. So let's dampen our skin again. <laughs> so now that we have dampened our skin, we're gonna take a bit of product on our fingers. Okay. Like just this much right here. That's all you oh, need. It doesn't even feel like an exfoliator. I know. Like it's, it's a very like a cream. subtle uh, exfoliator, and you're just gonna slightly start like. Putting all of your face and kind of going in circular motions to really get mostly to the areas I feel like around your T zone, really get into those pores around your cheeks. I just I feel like my nose really needs it. Like, yeah, I'll go that's a really, and everything. So I find it's a I huge problem area. Yeah. I, I want to put a little disclaimer I'm not a skincare specialist of any sort. I just love skincare. And I'm just giving you my own skincare that I use every night. Is it? The best products in the world i don't know <laughs> they're good for me and i enjoy them watch your under eyes this is the really the thinnest part of your skin so you don't want to damage it so just kind of go around it slowly and don't forget your lips too guys we want to exploit those lips and we're gonna wash this off and we'll be right back tapping your face dry that feels amazing i want to tell you about this little guy right here i did ex do some extractions so it is not a pimple <laughs> just healing can't see it. Thank you. Alrighty, guys, with another step, another sip. <laughs> Cheers, me this time. <laughs> I like this part. <laughs> Best part of our skincare. Well, how long does your skincare usually take, like every single night? Um, Not that long. If I'm not talking, obviously, and explaining the products, it takes me, you know, five, 10 minutes, maybe 15, depends. Like, obviously, if I'm doing it for a long period of time, but uh, sometimes I'll take my time. It's an experience, okay? <laughs> so uh, I do take my time, but like I can do it pretty fast in 15 minutes. So that's pretty good. Yeah, I can manage 15 minutes. Yeah, right? so I don't know. Alrighty, next product I have here is a toner. So now that we cleanse, we want to tone our skin. We want to get everything even. We want products that we're putting on top to really sink into our skin. So we need a toner. One of my other new favorite uh, skincare brands is actually Glow, Glow Recipe. This, and I've, I've actually only had, this is not the full size, I actually received a sample size of this and I'm obsessed, obsessed. It's a Glow Recipe Water Glow PHA plus BHA Pore Tight Toner. So the Pore Tight Toner. And yeah, that's all that it has on here, but this guy's made in Korea and they got some good skincare there, okay? Korea's got some good skincare, so I'm excited for this product. So first, you would need a little cotton pad. Here you go. Thanks. And we're gonna put this, isn't this such a pretty product? Look how cute that is. We're gonna dab some onto a, a cotton pad. Oh wow. Is this helps much? with hydration, this helps with tightening your pores, and you just put it all, all around, making sure to get everywhere. It really just helps. This product is so good. Really good product. I will 100% get the full size. I do have a lot of skincare because I do get subscriptions boxes and you get a lot of skincare and subscription boxes. So I do have to, a lot to get through, but once I do, I will definitely purchase the full size of this. Oh, so this is just a mini version. Yeah. This is how they get you, right? <laughs> Yeah, you like something and you want to get the, the so, big one. Mm -hmm. So, do you feel overwhelmed yet? <laughs> I have no idea. Half, I'm learning half of these things, uh, what they do. <laughs> Alrighty guys, you know, what that, you know what the time is. <laughs> another step, another sip. <laughs> Alrighty guys, next. I have, one of my problem areas is I get as I'm old, getting older, I feel like I get a few sunspots now. I have a few right here that I'm trying to get rid of. And with that, you need 
vitamin C. Vitamin C serums are so important for it to help brighten your skin, helps helps with hyperpigmentation, things like that. So I do love to go in with the uh, a vitamin C serum. So this is the one I'm using right now. It's the Summer Fridays. This is the CC Me Serum Brighten. Apply a few drops of serum to face and neck, avoiding the eye area, followed by your favorite moisturizer. But let's get right into it. And we're gonna actually do a little something fun this time around. We're gonna actually do some skincare tools. And we're gonna bring oh. it to this. So first off, we're gonna put a few drops. Is this something you use uh, in the morning too? I don't. I don't recommend using a. Um, a vitamin C serum in the morning because mm -hmm. you want to make sure it's you're not going in the sun afterwards unless you're putting a decent amount of, of sunscreen because vitamin C will make your skin more sensitive to the, the sun right and you don't want your skin to be any more damaged than you know you don't want to damage your skin you're trying to protect it right with vitamin C unfortunately you have to make sure to put your sunscreen every morning obviously but don't I wouldn't wear this product in the morning that's one thing I do. I do like to put sunscreen in the morning. Yeah, and that's really important. One of the number one most important products you ever do to your skin is put sunscreen. You want to protect from the sun. That's all year round. All right, guys. So we're going to talk about two tools. Now that we have our serums in, we want it to really penetrate, get in there, and do give us all the benefits. So I'm going to be using two skincare tools, two of my favorite. We're going to use one. You're going to use one and I'll use one. Okay. Do you think these actually work? <laughs> I do. Okay. I do. I, <laughs> Maybe this is something I don't agree. I feel I like... I not agree, but I don't think it... I think it's just a hoax. Yeah, no. I, I mean, I'm easily sold with things, so maybe, but I do believe there's a lot of research you know, that I'm, I haven't done, <laughs> but I, there's a lot of research that say that it's a really good product and I feel like it's great. It helps really like the lymphatic, uh, to drain your lymphatic areas and really just smooth out and contour your face, but also help things to really penetrate your skin. So let's get right into it. First off, we have the Nurse Jamie Roller right here. This guy is great for just like lifting this area up and just rolling it up and going all over. Make sure to always roll up. Yo, you're gonna use this. And I will be using actually one of my newer tools, which is the So Rich Roller. Um, again, I'll have everything uh, below. I feel like this was a rather expensive item. I wouldn't suggest it. I did get it in a boxy charm, so I'm happy to get it, but I would probably not spend that much. It looks crazy. But this is another roller. This helps with really contouring this specific area and also your cheekbones. So let's get right into it. I'm gonna first show you how I use mine. So we're gonna go right in between the neck area and just kind of roll that up. Really make sure you're contouring. So we're gonna make sure to really roll all this up. We're gonna go underneath like that. Just make sure to take this area. I don't feel like this is doing anything. Yeah, push hard, push hard on it and just like roll it up, roll it up. How do I do my forehead? Yeah, you go up, upward, stop. Like oh, up, up. Yeah, really. Nice. This is never push down in your face. You want the gravity to be pushed back up and not down, right? Because you know, once you age, gravity takes a hold of our face and <laughs> we start sinking a bit. <laughs> so using this tool, it's gonna help keep everything lifted. Hopefully. So you <laughs> really get <laughs> you really get right into there. Oh, My kid. sister's not believing me. I'm probably losing her right now. Uh, but this is what I do, guys, for oh beauty, right? We're still doing this right now. Okay. Okay. How long do we do this okay. for? Alrighty, guys. Now that we rolled our face and put that serum right in there. I know, she's making fun of me. She's not really enjoying it. We're gonna talk, try another product. Oh, before we do that, I almost forgot. <sighs> Hello, for each step we sip. <laughs> sip. <laughs> mm. Are we getting like warm in here? I feel like it's getting way Ooh. hotter in here. <laughs> <laughs> we're not drunk, <laughs> we're not tipsy guys. Alrighty guys, we're gonna test out another serum. That's my, I've been using this for the last seven to eight months, cause I'm trying to test it out. I have actually, this is my second or third bottle of this, so I, I want to do a review on it, so I am testing it out. It is the QMS Medic Cosmetics Lip Liner Corrector. This guy is really expensive. I don't know if it's worth it, you know, who knows, but it's uh, supposed to help with... It's a lightweight serum formulated to hydrate and plump the lips for a smoother, youth for youthful appearance. So let's try it out. We're going to dab a little bit of this. So you're gonna go all the way around. Make sure you're going above your top, top lip, all the way around to this area right here. 
I'm a person that really has an expressive face, facial, I have a really expressive face, so, you know, I don't know, a smile letter, right? So, <laughs> gotta protect those areas, so. There we go, guys. Look at fabulous so far. <laughs> Alrighty, next we're gonna get into another product. Wait, do we just keep it on our lips? Yeah, it's just a serum you just leave on your lips so it can be extra luscious. Oh, okay. Let me just. It'll dry up. Yeah, it's really like. Look at that glow, guys. We're getting some glowy skin. Look at that. What do you think so oh far? Oh my god, I think I'm gonna wake up with like a soft, soft, supple skin. Refreshed skin. <laughs> Alright, before we get into that, let's have a smaller sip because I feel like these steps are getting faster and faster. We're gonna be drinking a whole bottle soon. Mm -mm. Alrighty, guys, we're gonna get into another. I know this is a little extra, but I'm really puny lashes. I need some help, right? So I'm gonna be, I've been really consistent in using an eyelash serum actually, and this is the Lashes MD Lash Serum. This guy here is a eyelash and eyebrow conditioner. So hmm. it really helps to I'm excited add to use volume this. and thinness yeah. to your lashes. So uh, that's all I want, man. I yeah, just mine are so, so short too. So how long have you used this uh, for? I've been using it for about a month now, so it looks kind of like this. And have you noticed anything? Or? Um, yeah, I feel like my lashes are getting longer and thicker. You just go around the eye. And so you just leave this overnight? I do. And I do recommend, try doing your skincare an hour before you sleep at least because you really want to like not put all this product on and sleep and then you're just like rubbing all of that amazing expensive product all over your pillowcase, so you have to make sure to really do do your skincare at least an hour before. What do you? It feels like I'm just putting like eyeliners. And by the way, I would only let my sister use it because she's my sister. But I understand some people don't like to put eye uh, like eye products near their eyes or share any items that are near eyes. But she's my sister. I love her. We share everything, so we're good. <laughs> Alrighty guys, my next, so now that we have our serums on, we got exfoliated, we cleansed, we put all this stuff, that's the good stuff, okay? We really want to just like make sure that we're silifying everything and hydrating our skin even more by adding a moisturizer. Sorry, adding an eye cream first. Uh, I was going to do the moisturizer, but we're going to do the eye cream first. I like to use the Mirad Hydration uh, Hydrodynamic Ultimate Hot moisture for eyes. Woof, what a mouth, mouthful. So this is the stuff that I've been using. I kind of go through eye creams pretty fast. I don't really, like, I feel like I haven't found one that I'm, like, obsessed with yet. I do enjoy this one, but is it my favorite? Not sure. My This is my problem area, so I feel like I need all the help that I can get, and I'm still on the hunt for the best eye cream. So you just take a little bit like this, and you're going to take it. I'm using my nail because it's so long. You're gonna dab it just on the contours of your eyes. Make sure to get your lid too. And then you're gonna take a little more and do it on this side. And dab around like this. So you wanna do that? It's not as... I don't know what I'm doing right now. Yeah, you just dab a little bit. Make sure you always do your eyelids because, you know, that area really gets like, Do the eyebrow bone around here too. Really get in there. Okay. And, and just, just dab. dab it in there. Really. Dab it in there? Yeah, dab. Always try dabbing, never pulling. I think I put it too low on this side. Just blended. <laughs> I think I got my cheek here. <laughs> oh my god. It's alright, your cheeks need some love too. Oh, my cheeks burning. Oh no. My skin is not uh, used to this, uh, her, the her bougie. Skin, her uh, skin is not used to the bougie life. Nope. Used to soap and water. But I should add some other stuff too. Looking fabulous so far. Alrighty, get. So the last two steps in wow. our skincare routine. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. This is fun. Isn't it fun? Yeah. Well, I feel like we're not working. Okay, we're just taking your bare skin, mm -hmm. having fun and drinking while we're at it. <laughs> All right, next product. Uh, this is actually a new product I just got. It's brand new. I haven't even tested it yet, so I'm bringing my sister in to test it with me. And as I said, I do love Glow Recipe. It's one of my favorite skincare items. So this is the Glow Recipe Banana Souffle Moisture Cream. Look how adorable this cream is. Oh my goodness. I'm excited to try I this. I know. I need lots of uh, hydration. I'm, it is for hydration and calming, so this is going to be a great item. 
and looks, I don't really know if this smells like banana. No, no scent, which I prefer. I think I hate when products are too scented. It's like, why put all that scent in your product? It's not good for your skin. So it's nice that products are not scented. Actually, there's a little tiny banana smell. Mmm, it smells so good. You just put a little bit right there. I'm trying to use all the tap stuff. Mmm. Feel good? Yeah. So grab some. I love moisturizer. So my sister does use moisturizer every day. Yeah. That's one thing that she's really good at using. That is that and sunscreen. So. Yeah, it feels just so good when you put it on mm. in the morning. Like your skin feels so soft and hydrated and glowy. I love it. I like the feeling of this. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna take a little more. I use my nail because I don't want to dig into it. And I always put some on my neck. Let's put some on our neck too. And we're just gonna take it, put it around, and we're gonna go kind of like this, kind of push up. Mmm, that's like smelling like bananas. Mm -hmm. So good. It's just a light scent of bananas, nothing crazy, which I prefer. If I'm gonna have a scented product, I like it nice and light. All right, guys, look at that. <laughs> what do you? Oh, I love it. All righty, guys, final product. And before we do that, what are we gonna do? Sip. <laughs> Cheers. So final product we're gonna do, now that we have our lip serum on, we're gonna use my favorite lip balm, which I use every single night, and that is the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask in mint chocolate. I didn't even or know this sleeping mask. <laughs> yeah. I actually use this in the day sometimes too because I think it's a really hydrating lip balm. Just really just makes your lips super supple, super soft and smooth in the morning. I love it. And I use it throughout the day too because eh. So this is the, sorry, the mint choco. Choco? Coco? Let me see. Choco? Choco. 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 I think so. I don't know, but anyways, the, it's a lip sleeping mask and it provides smooth, firm lips by gently melting away dead skin on the lips overnight with refreshing mint choco scent. All right, let's get right into it. Mmm, smell that. Oh my God, that smells so good. I love mint. Mm -hmm. Oh, I like the way it feels. It's like and nice and thick. Yeah, and it's gonna be like hydrating and then... Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. I really like that way. And it smells so good. So you <laughs> sleep with this overnight? Mm-hmm, it just stays on and your lips are looking fabulous. Huh. Again, I have really dry skin, so I and I have dry skin everywhere. My lips too, so I need all the health that I can get. Ooh, I love the way it feels. Mmm, so nice. Okay. So tell me, what is your thoughts on my nine step skincare routine? Do you think this is a little overboard or would you take some of these items yourself and you know, slowly bring them into your skincare routine? Well, I mean, once you do it a couple of times, I feel like it's not so bad and it won't take too long. Um, but like, the, yeah, there is a few steps that I actually love. I like the moisturizer. Yeah, what's your favorite? Grab some of these items and tell me what your favorite items are. Okay, you can I love them. the way this feels. It feels Ooh, really nice. Yeah, um, I would probably try this for a month just to see if my eyelashes do grow because my eyelashes are so short. Um, I, I do like the exfoliator because like I said, I got a lot of blackheads, so this is something that I would like to do, and it's only two to three times a week. I can manage that. Mm -hmm. um, what else? Oh, I don't buy these tools. <laughs> these tools, no, I don't think I would use them. Really? I no. love them. And, um, yeah, I mean, I will see how my, feel, my face feels tomorrow. All right, keep me posted in the morning and tell me how supple and gorgeous your skin will look. I mean, it's nice to take care of my sister who's, you know, working super hard with a little small, uh, you know, almost two year old. So she's running around, okay? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and lack of sleep, okay? Yes. So uh, it's nice to have that nice skincare and have some good time with my sister. If you want to see her come back on this channel, mm -hmm. like this video below mm -hmm. because we would love to have her on this channel again. I mean, I would, because I love my sister. <laughs> Maybe you could do my makeup or something. Ooh, 
Ooh, if you like that, yeah. like this video and comment below because we'd love to hear from you. And anyways, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. Let me just take a small sip. Again, please like this video below and subscribe so we can have tons more fun on this channel. Yay! Bye! <laughs> I hope you all have a wonderful day. Bye, Bye guys! See you!